Hello, YouTube land. Welcome back to the Chaos Asylum. I am your host, the chosen one, Lee Wyatt, and I, with, uh, I once again, Kitty. Did I say Kitty, right? Yep. Okay. Kitty. Kitty. Um. And today is another monthly tri treats box that we got, and I believe it is from. No. Kitty um. always says where it's from. What's up? Japan. Mama's day. And ignore the fact that I don't remember who I called myself. Yeah, it's fine. Um, so yeah, we are trying uh, all these lovely treats here. Let me show the, the a box real quick. God. See, ladies and gentlemen, try treats. I, uh, yeah, there we go. I know it's a lot of shit. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Let me eat. A lot of goodies. A lot of goodies we're going to try out. Mm. So, pull. Go off, whatever. Are yes. Ready? Yeah. All right. First up is the Bolton rice candy. What? It's rice candy. Rice candy. Bolton rice candy is a traditional Japanese candy. It is soft, chewy, slightly lemon orange flavored candy with an outer layer of rice paper or olives. Thank God we got citrus. You don't need citrus. Yes, everybody, and I got a new haircut. Uh, I tried it, something new and, it, and whatnot. Everybody likes it, you know. I've been told I look like I'm uh, 18 again. What? Anyways. Ah, uh, look at this for free energy. All right, okay. <laughs> Why does it look like the Stave Puff Marshmallow Man, but from Japan? Okay. Did I say right, Japan? Yeah. Well, yeah. I guess we'll see if this so is a full so solid candy or... Oh! Oops! She's throwing stuff at me, ladies It's multiple. Ooh, what's this? It's a stick! <laughs> you can keep the stickers if you want. <laughs> so, this is what they come in. They're in individual packages. You just unwrap them. Um, I don't like rice, so I guess we'll see what's gonna well, happen. Well... Yeah, we have a trash can here for a reason. Just in case you don't like it, you can just spit it out. Eh, which I won't do on camera. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get the paper. Oh, it's kind of like uh, what Nana makes with the powder. The you see that? Look, see? <laughs> you know, the see? paper is a struggle. The, the, the paper but the struggles. I'm struggling like hell with this paper. This isn't... Okay, the paper is hell, though. The wrapper isn't. Yeah, what? The... Oh, come on. Okay, there we go. I can't even get the paper. I'm having so much hard. Um, it, but no, this, if you look at it, Taylor. Yeah, I know. I mean, I'm like, kitty. Oh, uh, not too late. <laughs> as a tip, whatever. It kind of looks like Nana's of candy, that hard candy with the powder. I'm having s the paper. I'm getting ready it to don't say have a smell. I'm getting ready to say screw it and eat the paper with it. Yeah. Uh, it don't have a smell, but this is what the candy looks like. I'm an idiot. I didn't read it. It's an edible layer of starch useful for preserved gelatin sweet by absorbing humidity, so you can eat it. This tastes well. Chewy. Yeah, it is chewy, very, very chewy. Oh. It has a lemony leaf flavor to it, like you said. It even says it right there. It I'm says an idiot. Each candy has its <laughs> individual wrapper. I'm an idiot. It says it right there too. We're over here trying to pick the <laughs> I'm, I, I hope you all enjoy the chewing. Um, We're sorry about it. Yeah. It's just this is chewy as hell. It looks like it's like gummy base this month. <clears throat> Excuse me. It seems like it has like a, a theme of every month of like something. Last month it was from uh, Mother Russia. And there's the picture. Yeah. Mother Russia. And it was nothing but chocolate almost. So this one, this month it's like from Japan and it's like gummy stuff. And I love gummy mm -hmm. stuff. Do you still have this from uh, Russia? Because I wouldn't mind lining my walls with these. Uh, I don't know. Maybe you could keep that though. Okay. <laughs> burgers? What the? You ready? Yes. Okay. This is every burger you can. They're cookies. Um, made of burgers. They're cheeseburger shaped cookies made up of flaky bun biscuits and with mini toasted sesame seeds as well as chocolate patty filling. They're incredibly cute and delicious. Incredibly cute and delicious? Yeah. Delicioso. Uh, you, you could have opened it from right there. Oh, well, too late. Oh, I guess we'll see. Oh, here's the wrapper. 
wrapper. It's kind of, it's kind of cool because if you think about it, it comes in a package like uh, ramen noodles. And right there is a picture of what it looks like. There we go. So this will be fun. All right, let's open. Look what they come in. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's like a little... <laughs> Well, they come in a little tray. And they're all destroyed. <laughs> I guess that's what happens when it goes... <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> this is what happens when cool key monster. Yeah, I don't know. So, yeah, they, they... I guess this is what happens when it travels from God knows where yeah. to where. So here we go. Let's try that again. I'm like trying to figure out where to buy it to where I won't drop it. Because I don't want to put the full thing in my mouth. I guess it's like a cookie, but it's just very chocolatey. If you want those, you can have them. <laughs> She's like, yeah! Yeah, me and Kitty. I, I share. If you like something, I'll, I'll let her keep it. Oh, wow. I'm gonna let you finish. I'm finished. Okay. Um, let me find that on here first. Okay. This is Kikori no Kirikabu. I'm sorry if I butchered the crap yeah. out of it's these right. names. Um, it's called, it's basically a lumberjack stump. They are cookies shaped like a tree stump and have a delightfully crunchy wheat cookie wrapped in sweet Japanese chocolate. Oh. Some more chocolate. <laughs> Every woman's favorite thing, chocolate. Oh, here we go. It's in the same basic thing. <laughs> wait, wait, is that in here too? Yeah. Damn. Go ahead and rip it open. Let's well, take a look at this. Don't yeah. rip it open. Oh, and here's the uh, packaging. Oh, that's a disappointment. There's nothing here. I thought maybe there'd be some uh, oh. comic like that one. Okay. But I wish I could read this, though. Yeah, right. What the? <laughs> Just break it off. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is cute. Just, like, look at it. That's supposed to be, like, a stump. It's a tree stump. Yeah. It's cute. Well, it bottoms up. It's like the uh, burgers, basically. Yeah, you can have it. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to get one snack. Yeah, what? That was good. Because you know, we kind of took that out the box. Oh. It doesn't have a comic. Yeah. Okay. Next up is. Mm, we're going to wait for that because I'm here. We'll go with this one. Which is Kaki No Tame. Crescent shaped soy flavored rice crackers with a crispy and crunchy texture. Okay. Oh, and many people in Japan enjoy this with a glass of beer. <laughs> you hear that? You can enjoy this with a glass of beer. You might, you want to just cut that. Yeah. Because it might just work better and not go everywhere. Ah, oh, right here is the thing that opens up. I love when you find how to open. It's not crap, but oh well. You can get the gist of it. Okay, if I can. Here's one for you and one for me. I might not actually. This is what they look like. They're a little. First, I thought these were maggots. I'm sorry. <laughs> maggots! Oh, that's salty as hell. I'm good. <laughs> I'm wow! Good. That is salty. Now I see why they just eat it with beer. Oh my god. Woo! Okay. You need a drink. Yeah. <laughs> and just set it down. I'm not putting the lid back on. Oh, uh, anywhere? Yeah. Okay. Alright, here you go. Lemonade crepe. Crepe, probably said that wrong. I gave it an accent. Biscuits. Uh, crispy crepe biscuits covered in a thin layer of slightly sweet and chocolate frosting. The light frosting prevents the crumbly crepe biscuit from falling everywhere so you can enjoy without worrying about the mess. It says it's a way to... It literally says you have to open it right there. Yeah, it's the best thing. You just follow the pictures. Uh, 
I'm gonna take it. Try to open this the way they're showing it though. Oh, here's what they look like in their little cute package thing. Little cute package. I mean, it's cute. Yeah. Well, there's you. And now me. I still this got a horrible like. taste. This is what they open their phone apart though. Uh, I still got a horrible taste from those. Oh god. So this is gonna be fun. Yeah. Oh, ready? I'm keeping the package on. Mm, I don't really care for it. Very crunchy. I'm just gonna take these off. To make it a little easier right now. Yeah, if you want these, you can tell me. Yep. Um, you want to just finish that one? You want these two? <laughs> the solid crap. They're not crap, but they're solid as hell. Yeah, we'll try that last, too. That'll be fun to try. Mm -hmm. Uh, you can keep... I'm just looking for everything, so... Okay. I hope these aren't actually made with shrimp because if so, I'm not going to try them. Um, oh, this is the thing I forgot to show on the lemon things we just tried. They show how to open it on the back. Yep. Yeah. Shrimp chips. Okay. Um, baked shrimp trip. Yeah, there we go. Shrimps. Damn it. <laughs> shrimp. <laughs> they have a shrimp flavor virtually unheard of in America. It is one of the most iconic snacks in Asia. You might not be used to the taste at first, but try them. They could be addictive. At least I know they're not actually... Just <laughs> taste them from me. At least I know they're not actually made of shrimp, so that's the good thing. She just steals them. Because I had a feeling if you kept doing that, they would have worn everywhere. Pop! It would have been like a, a, a one of those poppers up for 4th of July going off. Ignore me, Rena. Yeah, that smells more like fish food. <laughs> I'm not gonna try one. Here we go. I'll stick to not this round. Mm. <clears throat> and I am not sorry for not trying them. I just don't condone to eating anything shrimp like, it, or fish. It does taste like fish. It tastes like fish chips. Okay, Japanese rice crackers. Okay. Gotta find it. Here it is. Himamaru crackers. Gold and hued deep fried rice crackers in the shape of a shell. Crunchy with a light soy sauce flavor, this treat light. achieves the perfect balance between sweet and salty while retaining an incredibly crispy and fresh texture. You want some help? I'll just see if there's a. Yep, yeah, okay. This is back here. Is it like. Kind of looks like um, what are they called? Um, oh, tater tots. tots. Yeah. If you look at, look them, at the tater tots. they look like it's tater, tater tots. tots. They're not tater tots, but they look like them. Um, at least these don't have a fishy smell. Yeah. They can't pick the taste. Yeah. Uh, that hit my tongue. Nope. <laughs> Ignoring me over here. My taste buds do not like that. No. Okay. This is gum. It's blueberry gum, as you can tell. Uh, it's richly flavored fruit gum. Oh, it, all it is is gum by latte. It doesn't actually have a name. There's nine sticks. <laughs> uh, we'll probably try this last, very last, because we have two more things. Okay. Um, I'm still gonna read it. Latte has been, long been loved as a gum maker with a history of releasing delightful, juicy flavors. The gum's refreshing flavor and aroma also is due to the fact that they use sh shiso, a type of Japanese mint, to complement the juicy flavor, which we will try later. Giant Caplico. Uh, this is gonna be very fun to figure out how to share it. Because this Take looks one bite from one side, the other bite. This from looks the other. like a messed up ice cream. Yeah. 
It looks like a drumstick. Yeah. Um, looks like an ice cream cone, but instead of containing ice cream, the cone contains thick and fluffy layer of strawberry filling, encompassing an inner layer of chocolate filling. It is not ice cream, but just that is awesome. Ow, oh, and it shows you how to open it too, yep. even though you can't really see it on here. Yeah. It's the sticker with the blue <laughs> tree effects. <laughs> oh god. And, and, it, and it looks exactly like a drumstick. It's an ice cream cone yeah. around it. And you can smell the chocolate too, it's very chocolatey. Uh, I'll go for I would say this. take a bite off one side or and I'll take a bite off the other. I can tell you it's gonna take a while to get to the strawberry. The strawberry in the middle? Yeah. I don't really care for it. It's okay, just not something I care for. I'll eat that later. It's chocolatey. There's a strawberry in the middle, but oh. Uh, Don't get it, me wrong, I love chocolatey stuff, but it's not something I care for. If you had a drumstick before an ice cream cone, it has like a bit of a mint flavor Ooh. to it, too. My God. It's like, oh my God. I'm gonna be on a chocolate brush today. Me, <laughs> Damn it. Okay, let's see if I can find this one. Okay, I found it. It says it right here too. I'm an idiot. You're not. Stop it. I didn't see the name. It's called Fettuccine. Gummy. Fettuccine. Gummy Cola are fun-shaped gummy candies that looks like short fettuccine noodles. Fettuccine. How do you oh, say gummy. It? Ooh. This cola-flavored gummy candy is coated with bits of sugar and sour powder for a yummy crunch and in each chewy bite. Hey. Oh. Got it. I was just looking at the back of it. Ooh, it smells good to you. Like when you open it, the, the, the smell hits you. Hey, right at least know. it has a uh, zip lock thing. Yeah. So they won't go back. Oh, that's got me. One for you. Oh, thank you. Hey. And one for me. I can't. Never call. I'll take those. Thank you. <laughs> She's like, no. The way I spit that out, though. What's up? Uh, <laughs> when you're done. It's gummy. What? It's it's gummy and soury. Um, and it does have a bit of a oh, taste to it. And we're going. The last thing is the uh, gum, right? Yeah. Um, and it has a tab right here for you to open it. Yeah. Oh, here we go. These are some big sticks to go. Wow, there she are. Well, there you go. Oh wow, it actually smells really ah, good too. Cool. And they are blueberry, and mine has a heart. Aww, <laughs> that's the heart. I wonder, do they like have different, they do. They have Did different they? designs. Cool. Uh, it doesn't really matter how big that. Nope. You can show all the different designs if you want to know if it's fine. Here's this design. I'm an idiot when it comes to designs because I love designs. This one. <laughs> The one I had is all nothing but blueberry. This one. This one I got all. That's blueberry. also on this one. There's this one. Nice. This one and one I already showed you again. Okay, time to this, try. This feels different compared to our like plastic of our gum. Hey, it feels compared better. It to, uh, like we have foil and this this feels like a lot more. Yeah. And here's what they look like, even though you can't really tell because it'll like. I guess you just show it in her face. See, oh, there we go. See, here we go. Ooh, this tastes good. I don't like blueberry. Well, I guess we can split it. One, uh, <laughs> one, one, one. And then there's one because there's nine. One. Um, so there we go, ladies. Oh. I thought these were okay. Okay, you can have those. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen. That is Tri Treats for the month from Japan. Uh, and if you want your own Tri Treats box, go to tritreats.com. And there's two different boxes. There's one that's like a smaller box, like $13 and some change. And there's one we got that's a bigger one. And it's like $25 and some change. So if you like this video, <laughs> blow a bubble. <laughs> 
So, like I always say, hello to all the new subscribers out there, and welcome to the Chaos Asylum. We're going to be doing this every month. The track trees box is going to be from different places all the time. And if you haven't already, smash that subscribe button. Later.